3M can equal, any Roman numeral folks here? 1,500 Roman numerals? But it can also equal pain. Does equal pain. And I've been in this space long enough that I've learned people don't use those kind of nice business euphemisms like we have a challenge or we have a hurdle. They talk about physical pain. There's pain somewhere in your organization struggling to try and deal with that data. So I'm going to show you what pain looks like. This kind of graphic. Take a moment. I call it naked data because there's no way to hide from it. Here's what it is. There you go. That's the problem. A lot of heads nodding here right now. These are from embarrassingly large global enterprises that don't know what they're doing with Coca-Cola, that can't seem to key in Nestle the same way twice, that don't understand what they're doing with 7-Eleven. You didn't find it already, 7 equals 11? <laughs> Not base 10. This is what you are dealing with. This is the garbage in. And so if you didn't, haven't created your own what I call shame report, to show this to your business stakeholders, to say, here's how we can't move forward because we're dealing with this crap is a nice way to say it. That's what you've got to do. And this last column here came from a company that has a retail sales organization. So they put people in stores. They had over 275 different configurations of the 7-Eleven banner name. A lot of creativity in the field, none of it selling product. <laughs> And if you think the software is going to fix it on its own, you put this in Excel and you get July 11th. <laughs> Unless you go to Europe and of course you get November 7th, so it doesn't work either way. <laughs> so common problems. I'm sure you all have your own 7-Eleven slide that you want to show your business stakeholders.